It's too high. Get away from it. Move out of it. There's better, more efficient ways. You know, those other visual graphical interface tools. But my opinion here is like, look, the 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 game that we're playing here has changed. I'm no longer comparing do I use Dataflows Gen 2 versus Talent. Right. I'm actually comparing do I use Dataflows Gen 2 versus a Python notebook or a, a user-defined data function or something else, right? So I, when I look at the information that I'm given, the, the the game of which I use comparisons are it's totally different. And so I think the pricing of whatever the Dataflows Gen 2 is just wrong. It's too high, get away from it, move out of it. There's better, more efficient ways as a user, I want to be able to move gigabytes of data for as cheap as I can. That's that's what I want to do. And so I think these new tools that are put in our hands, Python notebooks, Spark notebooks, they're much better designed, even data flows. Um, there, there's all these pipeline things. They're much, uh, they're much more efficient now than what they used to be. And so that's yeah. the whole game to me has changed. And this I, is, the best I love this game. Though. Yeah, <laughs> this is this. The game has changed because I was studying this in college right. in my master's degree around this. And so it's been really nice because I love the BI space. I understood the semantic models. And all of a sudden I get all this big data technology that just right. shows up to to work with fabric. And I'm like, man, this is my two worlds colliding. Right. My love of Power BI and my love of big data and technology pieces. And boom, now we're here in the same place and I can do these really incredible projects yeah. for a fraction of the cost I could and before. 